testosterone. It's what makes us men. Some men develop low testosterone, and there's a lot of confusion about it. My name is Dr. Mark Richman, a urologist at Obsidian Men's Health. Today, we're gonna to dispel some of the myths about low testosterone. We're gonna to try to answer some of the questions you might have about men's sexual health and we're perhaps too afraid to ask. We're gonna dispel the myths, we're gonna separate truth from fiction, we're gonna let you know what's normal and when you need to see a doctor. Testosterone deficiency is a condition where the body does not produce enough of this hormone. It can lead to symptoms including fatigue, depression, difficulty building muscle mass, and even sexual dysfunction. One of the questions I get asked in my office all the time by men, is this a normal part of the aging process? Am I supposed to have low testosterone? And the simple answer is no. It is true that as men get older, testosterone levels do fall somewhat. We certainly don't expect an 80-year-old man to have the same testosterone level as a 20-year-old guy. But every man needs a certain amount of testosterone in his system to avoid the symptoms of testosterone deficiency. Another myth that I need to dispel is that low testosterone only occurs in older men. It is true that as we get older, the chances that we will develop low testosterone does go up but low T can occur at any age. The treatment of low testosterone is testosterone replacement therapy, otherwise known as steroids. A lot of my patients have concerns about using steroids, and the fact is that steroid abuse is dangerous. But using steroids to treat low testosterone is completely safe. As soon as I bring up the subject of steroid use, men raise concerns over the issue of roid rage. The truth of the matter is, that low testosterone levels can cause anger and irritability. When used appropriately, steroids can actually improve a man's temperament. So let me dispel the myth of roid rage. There is no scientific evidence that steroids, even when abused, causes anger or rage. It's a complete myth. One of the biggest concerns men raise regarding testosterone therapy surrounds the issue of prostate cancer. This is a very confusing subject, so I want to make this clear. Low testosterone actually increases your risk for developing prostate cancer. Testosterone therapy can actually reduce that risk. However, there's a very important exception. For men who have prostate cancer or develop the disease, testosterone therapy can stimulate it to grow faster. So you have to be screened for the disease and monitored during therapy. I hope I was able to dispel some of the myths surrounding low testosterone and its treatment. Please subscribe to our channel if you'd like to see more videos on men's sexual health. If you have any questions or topics that you would like to see covered in future videos, please leave it in the comments below.